Okay, Kevin and I are going to be trying some craze. I have uh, toasted corn crisps in my two packages. I have the plantain and the guava. And mine are the corn crackers. I have seeded, roasted corn, and coconut. So these were sent to us from Sarah in California. I have personally never seen this brand around here. So I think it's cool that Sarah finds new things for us to try. She found them in California, but they're actually made in Miami, Florida, which is also named. Uh, toasted Corn Crisp is this 100 calories per serving. They're vegan and gluten free. Uh, you can pair it with uh, like a cheese ball. You can dip it. Um, you can put it with other things. Uh, but the the main ingredient in this is plantains. So, so it's hundred dollars for the whole package. For the whole package, yes. So, oh yeah, and you get you get yeah. uh, those yeah. are interesting. They're Wasn't very expecting thin. That. You get one, two, three, four, five, six for a hundred calories. So do you just want to break it? Sure. Sorry, broke yours. Tastes like a plantain. Mm hmm. Um, banana plant. Their website is www.gocrazecraze.com. So, what flavor is that? Just the regular? That was just the just toasted plantain. corn crisp. Yeah. Um, so, it is plain, but. You can still taste. It's very distinct plantain flavor. Mm -hmm. oh. I don't mind it though. It's not bad. It's kind of plain, but it's I don't very, very plain. It. Let's Let's try the touch guava. of salt to it. That would have been really good. Uh, well, and the thing is, is I think they thought they were salty, but they're not. It's only 120 milligrams. It's not a lot. Of, you don't get a lot of salt. This is the guava, and so this one is 110 calories. So, and this one is also broke all to pieces. So yeah, these are, there's more in here, but they are in uh, little pieces. Guava jam is the first ingredient. Ooh. Wow. If you like guava, you would like these. Mm, they it's have, a it, it's a very strong flavor. They did a good job with it. It would not be something that I would want. Um, but that kind of citrusy kind of. It's a very, very citrusy. It's a very tart citrus. Mm -hmm. Like a citrus melon kind of mix. Mm -hmm. Guava has always been a little weird to me. In that crisp. And if you can get, if you can fill the bag and you can fill them to where they should be like, like whole and not like this, then you'll be able to dip it into something if you want to. Um, as a matter of fact, Ashley had just bought some, um, it was kind of a fruit spread, it was white, mm -hmm. and you buy it in a tub in the produce section, that would be great to dip the, that yeah. guava in, is that fruit spread. Um, okay, so now these are the toasted corn crackers. They are gluten-free, vegan, uh, non-GMO kosher, uh, let's see, seeded toasted corn cracker. So flavorful and crunchy, you'll never look at a tortilla chip the same way again. These are 130 calories for the seeded. And these are all together. Look at that. The they, same thing. Yes, but it's, uh, yeah, it's just. Um, it's like a communion cracker. Mm-hmm. Oh, I like that. Hmm. I'm going to. Kind of reminds you of the um, sesame sticks. Yeah, it has sesame seeds in it. Mm -hmm. That's really good. The first ingredients are pre-cooked white corn flour, black seed, white corn grits, and then sesame seeds. Mm -hmm. That's my favorite so far though. Yeah, I yeah. love that sesame seed flavor and I love it in that form. And that would be a great snack right there. Be. That's a that's a really good one. That truly is very good. And I wouldn't add anything to that. Mm. I would eat it just plain. That is very good. This is the roasted corn. Uh, roasted corn is 120 calories. Kind of looks like the first one. Looks like the first one? Yeah, the first one. Okay. Roasted corn. Mm. 
This one, right after pre-cooked white corn flour, is coconut. It does have kind of a corn chip kind of flavor. It tastes like a corn chip, but even though coconut is the second ingredient, I don't taste coconut. No, I don't either. You would not know that coconut was in there. Mm -hmm. It tastes like a corn chip, but um, you're not getting the same texture as a mm -hmm. corn chip. So corn uh, tortilla chips or corn chips, they're kind of rough. These are um, very flat and very smooth. It's like it's like going over to a wall. And a plaster, that's what it feels like. It feels like plaster, honestly. A plaster wall, it's very, very smooth. Um, but I like that. Um, I still like the seed at the best, but that would be my second. So I'm guessing that I'm just gonna like the crackers more than the crisps. This is actually coconut, and it's 140 calories. So this is the highest calorie one that we have. And these, some of these are broken, so I'm just gonna, I'll show you. They pretty much look like the other ones. Yeah, they do. So here, I'll just give you that half. Tastes coconut. You know, which is amazing because, let me tell you why. Coconuts that also, the ingredients are the same order. It's pre-cooked white corn flour. They must have added though some um, coconut, oil. coconut oil in this one that they didn't in this one because you do not taste coconut, coconut in milk, this one. Coconut something. Uh, this, <clears throat> I love that. Mm, you very, very really good. taste uh, that coconut. That is so delicious. That's good. I like the coconut and the seeded. Either one of those mm -hmm. I'd go for. Well, any of the crackers in general, I would leave the crisps. There's nothing wrong with the crisps, but I just didn't like them there as much. But these crackers, these are awesome. Mm -hmm. These would be my top two, definitely. And okay. it's honestly, it's hard for me to choose between the uh, the seeded and the coconut because that coconut is so delicious. The coconut's almost more of a sweeter flavor, whereas it the is seeded sweet. more is a savory. Type I agree. Thing. I agree completely. Uh, but this one, this one is good too. It's just the plainest of the three crackers. Um, but these, I have no idea where Sarah found them, how much they cost. Do they sell them in bigger bags? I have no idea. I do like this size bag though because I think this is a good size to control how much you eat. Um, but if I, you care about that kind of thing. If you care about <laughs> that kind of thing. But I do wonder if they sell them in bigger bags. So these are very, very good. Mm -hmm. So thank you so much to Sarah for sending them to us. I hope you all enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.